It started with a spark. A pickaxe striking stone. Digging for gold like a compliment. A flame burning across the crest of a stone wave. Spreading until it became a city. A thousand golden lights shining brighter than all of the rings on Dylan Doug's fingers. So how much sunshine does it take to brighten the world? Over 300 days a year, this landlocked lighthouse, guiding the world safely to the shores of our granite ocean. A May snowstorm is only a cry for attention. A child, tugging at her mother's skirt, the stone ripples of its cloth, cascading across the front range. The tracks of the California Zephyr spreading like veins form her open arms, waving her children in for dinner. The gentle horizontal curve of Colfax is her hip, where she balances her children, raising us higher and higher, because the sky is never enough, when we already know that we can touch it, when we can fingerprint the atmosphere. trained us screamers. We clean air singers. We west side dancers. We five points jazz swagger. We are a game of street ball played under a Park Hill sunset. We are a 16th street love story. We know that green chile is its own food group. That it's not a birthday party unless it comes with sopapilla and cliff divers. That shoes are always optional. That an amphitheater is best when it's natural. That large blue statues of animals are national treasures. That the world will not wait for you so you build it for yourself. That it's important to know who our heroes are and to treat them accordingly, which means just like everyone else. This is an elevated stage. The world is watching. So sing for them, or just yourself. When the air is thin, it makes your heart bigger. We know how to dream here. Our bodies have learned to pull what they can from the atmosphere. That's why we're a little crazier here. We play a little harder here, this home, this town, this speaker stone city, this cow town high noon symphony, waiting for the rest of the world to catch up, to look them in the eyes while grinning and say, yeah, all those tall buildings sure are beautiful, but have you seen our mountains? That's what a skyline supposed to look like.